The technology that drives most consumer electronic products advances so fast that today's latest, greatest cell phone, laptop, or tablet often becomes tomorrow's obsolete, unwanted electronic waste. Properly disposing of all of those old iPhone 3s and Pentium 4 computers can be a challenge for local solid waste authorities and municipalities, but that's where the DEP's Covered Electronic Device Recycling Program comes in. The DEP recently awarded more than $177,000 in grant funding to applicants from Berkeley to Wood Counties and more than 20 others in between. The grants will help fund things like labor and advertising for collection events, recycling services, equipment rental, and ongoing collection programs. The grants range from $1,500 to $10,000 and are funded through fees collected from electronics manufacturers who register their brands with the state. The program was established in 2008. To see a complete list of this year's grant winners, visit our website, dep.wv.gov. Finally, you'll find all kinds of wildlife in and around the rain garden here at DEP headquarters. Frogs, butterflies, squirrels, and now eels. Eels? Yes, in the parking lot. But these aren't the slippery, swimming in the ocean kind. They're actually erosion eels. Mesh tubes filled with chunks of recycled tires, and they help protect the rain garden from stormwater runoff. Stormwater runoff is one of the leading causes of water pollution, and the rain garden helps slow down and filter it before it reaches the city storm sewers and eventually the Kanawha River. The eels add another layer of protection. They're designed to let water pass through while stopping some of the materials that would clog and pollute the rain garden. Using the eels helps keep the rain garden healthy and doing its job. Rain gardens are a great way to help control stormwater runoff around your home. They're not hard to build and maintain, and this is a great time of year to plan where to place them on your property. We leave you now at Sandstone Falls on the New River. On behalf of all of us at the West Virginia Department of Environmental Protection, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.